guys welcome back to another video i know i haven't been posting some days but guys guys but but guys if you didn't know i actually got some new dinosaurs that i recently added to the collection like this so we have some eggs and some eggs we're gonna be cracking them and there are different dinosaurs guys there are different dinosaurs and let's learn some dinosaurs today okay this you might see this you think yeah this is actually new it came with the new dinosaurs as well it was two packs my uh we like we bought two packs of dinosaurs let's go so first of all we have i finally know this name this is actually i think a Lambiosaurus, yes, and we have a uh, Ankylosaurus, and I name him Maku. I like to name my toys sometimes if if they're pretty if if they're pretty weak. Like, sorry guys, surface stuttering. Uh, like recognizable, yeah. And th this is new. This is actually kind of pretty 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 new. I think like third yesterday. I don't know, but. But this is actually recently added to the collection. Okay, guys. Next is a uh, new Spinosaurus. I only picked my new dinosaur figures cause, cause I wanted to show you guys. Yes. Now I have three Spinosaurus, or maybe four. I will surprise you in the end. And I think this is a very awesome Spinosaurus. Very red, and I think. I think the texture feels very wet, so it feels very slippery. Next, we have uh, I think I actually found out the name for this dinosaur, a Kentrosaurus, because I went to search on Google Kentrosaurus, and this is actually Kentrosaurus. His his mouth is kind of looks like it's dried out, or maybe he dig his mouth into sand, you know. Next is we have a Carnotaurus. Carnotaurus is known as the meat-eating bull. Yes, the meat-eating bull. Yes. Because the horns make it look like a bull. And this Carnotaurus cannot stand very well. So, let's just let, make him do that. We have the old T-Rex. You, you, did, you did see this in... This is Kane, I think, in episode 1 of Dino Adventures. It, I think episode of Two of Dino Adventures can be made tomorrow. I don't know. We still don't know yet because I'm actually pretty busy. Everything, guys. Please, if you hear noises in the background, don't just ignore it. Okay. We have a very awesome T-Rex, but uh, but not scientifically. The head is shaped very not like T-Rex. We have also another new one. Which is the T-Rex new one I brought into the video, but not all of them. A Saltosaurus. This is actually my first Saltosaurus. I'm pretty happy of that. This is a Saltosaurus. See? Okay, guys. Next, we, we have this. This is my favorite. I love this Stegosaurus from all of my new ones, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I love this Stegosaurus so much. I, yeah. The last one on the black box is Dimetrodon. Yeah, and so that are done. Uh, I'm still pretty worried because there might be a chance it might be a Uranosaurus, but but it has sharp tooth. It was like oh yeah, sharp tooth. But some toys are actually made as herbivores, but they have sharp tooth for designs. So I'm still not very sure of this as a Dimetrodon. But I trust my instincts. Uh, that this is not a Dimetrodon. Okay. Which egg shall we crack first for this video? I think I should say the gray one. Triceratops one. Oh, the, the tree got knocked down. Let's put the tree back. Okay, so let's... I know how to crack this in one hand now. Just gotta, like, press this part here. And boom. Yep, guys. T-Rex collection has increased. We have a minifigure of a T-Rex. Let's put it beside T-Rex and let's put the edge oh and let's put the eggshells on the black box and just make this back standing again. Let's put the T I mean let's put this back in standing position. I think this might not stand but it can actually stand. There we go. Next one is the last one. The brown 
ink baby in Kylosaurus egg. Guys, please, if you hear noises in the background, don't just ignore it. Okay, okay, let's open. Okay, let's pop it. Oh, pretty tough. Okay, there we go, there we go. Okay, now we just need to pop this part. Oh, there we go. It was hard. Boom, guys. Yup. And also, yup. That's why it was so hard because it was tightened because there was two minifigures in it. You have a minifigure Spinosaurus. It's green and yellow. Kind of looks like the offspring of my other Spinosaurus who is also green and yellow. We have a Brachiosaurus who has the same color as the uh, T-Rex. There might be a chance this is not the Brachiosaurus or I don't know. Oh wait, this is the Brachiosaurus I think. But this is an awesome figure. I love it. And wait a minute. It, 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 it has the same design as all my Brachiosaurus. Like the, uh, the neck going up and the knee like that. Yeah. So this is practically the same to all my Brachiosaurus. Okay, so guys, that's the end of the video. And I hope you like this. I'm sorry for not posting. I think, I think I'm going to post a new video on tomorrow. And guys, I hope you like this video. And thank you for support. And also guys, shout out to a channel named Dan Surprise. He's actually the one who inspired me to make videos of dinosaurs and collect dinosaurs. And I absolutely love it. I never had any like... Uh, I give up, yeah. I still collect dinosaurs to this day. See this? It is pretty awesome. Bye.